Welcome back to My Family's Got Guts. Ben Lyons here, joined by Asha Kierton. We are hey. high above the Extreme Arena floor. The semifinals are underway, and we're ready for our next event, Formula Guts. That's right, we've turned the arena into a racetrack, and our teams are going to compete. Going around the track in these really cool, souped-up pod bikes. Never seen anything like this before. Should be a lot of fun, Asha. Certainly should. Should I break down the rules for Please you? Please do that for me. All right, the object of Formula Guts is to make two and a half laps round the oval track in the fastest time possible. Two players from each team will ride. They have to make a pit stop halfway through and switch riders. First place gets 100 points, second 75 points. All right, I can't wait. And don't forget, a trip to the mighty Agro Bowl is at stake. Our competitors are really going to be bringing it in this one. Let's kick things off with the Red Squad, the A-Game Andersons. Starting things off, we're going to have Rick driving, then they're going to hit the pits where Cody will take over, and they're going to get some help with Austin and Trey as the pit crew. The extreme Arena is ready to explode. Asha, let's start the race. All right, players, on your marks. Get set. Here comes Rick trying to get to maximum speed in that opening straightaway. He gets the green flag from our official, and we're off. Here comes Rick around those first turns. Very difficult to not tip over in one of those pod yes. bikes. Corners are crucial. You've got to get around them. You've got to get your fastest time around them as well. You don't want to slow down at all. That's right. The A-game Andersons are approaching the pit. This is where you make your time or you lose your time. Let's see how they do. The Rick pulls up to the pit. He's got Austin and Trey helping him switch because Cody is ready to tackle our course. That's right. The pit crew have to get in there. They've got to keep that fastest time because it is about fast time in this racetrack. Formula He's Guts is a team sport. There you see Cody getting ready to launch off, to explode here onto the track. There she goes. There she and is. here we are. It's a tough start at the beginning, but she's back on track, ready to bring it home for the A-Game Andersons. Folks, this is the semifinals. The winner is going to head on to the Agro Bowl. Every event counts. Every point counts. Every second counts as she goes to the finish line. There you have it. A strong run for the A-Game Andersons here to kick things off in Formula Guts. What's the result? Well, they certainly stepped up to this track. They finished in a minute, three seconds. Don't forget, going into Formula Guts, they were in the lead. They got 60 points in the air slalom. Right. They're in the lead over the green squad who's taking the track right now. We're going to go around the horn first and find out who's playing a little bit of Formula Guts. We've got Tony kicking things off. He's the first driver for the green squad. Then we've got Caleb, who's going to bring it home. Then we've got Kaylee and Christina in the pit crew. Okay, Asha, the time now has come for Formula Guts, so start it off. All right, players, on your marks, get set. Tony kicking things off for the green machine, trying to get up to maximum speed as he gets the green flag. The green squad is off. They're going to have to do very well here in Formula Guts if they want to yes. head on to the Agro Bowl. Certainly. You know, the red team finished in a minute, three seconds. This is what the green team are chasing. They also want to get to the Agro Bowl, the championship round. Can they do it? That's right. Things are getting extreme as they head into the pit. Tony is now going to have some help from Kaylee and from Christina in the pit crew. The pit is where you make your time. You got to get it in is. and out as fast as possible and as safely Absolutely. as possible. You Absolutely. might trip and fall. Yeah, it's a team sport. It's certainly, especially when it comes to the pit crew, they've got to work with the riders to get them in there and to get back out on the track. It looks and get like they're time. set. The pit is done. We got Caleb now who's going to bring it home. He was great in the air slalom. Now here he is on the Formula Guts track. He's flying around He's those flying. turns. Looking like Tony Stewart as he hugs the side. Oh, he took it to two wheels. Oh, taking good. out our stunt crew. He wants it that badly. There it is. The finish line has been crossed. Wow. That was a great race, yes. Asha. What was their time? It certainly was a great race. Get this. They finished one second in front in a minute and two seconds. They've taken out Formula Guts. Oh, wow. I knew it was close. Congratulations to the Green Machine. Let's see how they won Formula Guts with the replay. Here you have the Red Squad doing everything they can to make this one close, but it was the green team in the pit able to make a fast switch. That's where you win Formula Guts, Asha, in it the pit. Is. Yeah, you see Caleb Ooh. going off the course there. Our safety crew on the case as always, but 
Caleb was victorious for the green team. Green machine, looking like a well-oiled machine here in Formula Guts. Everybody's got some good sportsmanship, though. That's nice to see. All right, now, before we go to the next event, let's go to the leaderboard. Well, with two events down, the A-game Andersons are in the lead on 135 points, and the green machine in second place on 110 points. Back in the prelims, we had two events before the aggro crag, but it's semi-final time, so we've added a third event to push our families to the limit. We call this one Volley Brawl. That's right, the Extreme Arena has been transformed into the Extreme Beach. Our players are going to fly through the air and spike volleyball after volleyball getting served up from their other player. This is going to be a lot of fun. So let's go to Asha for the rules. Well, the object of Volley Brawl is to spike as many balls as possible over the net and into the scoring zones. Each spike is worth 10 points, and of course, the team with the most points wins. The beach is getting hot. Our players are set. Asha, let's play some Volley Brawl. Players on your marks. Get set. The A-game Andersons taking on the Green Machine. Only one of these families will go on to the mighty Agro Bowl. There you see our players serving them up and spiking them down. Communication is the key. The spikers has to talk to the setter. The timing is very important. There you see the green team, a good one there over the net, spiking it down. We've got Rick and Austin working together for the A-games. They're going up against Caleb and Kaylee for the green machine. Trey and Cody, as well as Tony and Christina. The whole family's involved here in Volley Brawl on my family's got guns. A tough serve there for the Red Squad. You got to work as a unit, a well-oiled machine, because that net is 10 feet high above the sand. Our players are doing everything they can to spike as well as block. That's right, you can play defense, blocking them as they're trying to score in those colored zones. This is not for Kerry Walsh or for Gabby Reese, because this is too extreme. As we approach 30 seconds left in Volley Brawl, there you see the green squad, led by Spikers Caleb and Tony, doing their thing. Very difficult to get your footing in that sand and explode into the air. There's a block right there from the A-games, bringing their A-games to the beach. As we have 10 seconds to go, Spikers and serve, serve and spike. You gotta get in a routine here. A few more seconds in Volley Brawl. Every spike counts. And there you have it, the final horn. Volley Brawl is in the books. How many spikes do they get? Asha, give me the results. The Green Machine, 12, 12 spikes for 120 points. A game Anderson's 14 for 140 points. Congratulations to the Red Squad. The A game Andersons have won Volley Brawl. Let's go to the replay and see how they got it done. Guts. We're going to kick things off, though, with the green machine looking like a well-oiled machine here. Flying through the air using the left hand, the right hand, whatever it takes. But ultimately, too much of the A game Andersons. Rick and Trey were, were getting spiked after spike. Cody and Austin were setting them up. There you have it, the A-game Andersons victorious in Volley Brawl. This is setting us up for what's sure to be an amazing aggro crag. But first, let's go to the leaderboard. The aggro crag is looming. The green machine, 230 points. A-game Andersons, 275. Up next, in a bid to make it to the aggro bowl, our teams are going to face off in a four-player relay against the mighty aggro crag like you've never seen it before. 